Hi guys, come off here. We're gonna play Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. We're gonna unlock the new character, Paul Dameron, from the Resistance. Event Part 2. From the movie, actually. I like the backgrounds. I like the... What is it called again? Hope you enjoyed the video. Anyway, I like the, the backgrounds, the art that I've been seeing on the internet. I think I should buy the art book, though. Maybe I will. Who knows? But the thing is, I like his outfit at least. But... I can say I liked him when he was a pilot, but still when he's a fighter, pretty cool. At least. His outfit and stuff. The sad part is... That when I see from the concept, it could have been much better. Just my opinion though. <clears throat> I like to fight with the Jedi, pretty cool. Though it's just my opinion. Ha, huh, fool. But anyway, I got a very nice... Uh, yeah, pretty nice day today as well. Also, <clears throat> I'm a bit tired. But anyway, I do this for free and I enjoy the game. Pretty fun. Also, I'm really happy that one person that I chose as a special character to help me in one of the... What was it? Ah. In one of the fighting areas that you need to unlock a special character shard. I got help from another player online. With a Revan. I think it's a Revan character. With three Sedas, anyway. And that character helped me a lot. And I'm very thankful for that. <coughs> Sorry, my fault. There we go. Anyway, I'm very thankful for that. And I finally got... <coughs> End my hood. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Anyway, I finally... I finally got help with one of the stages that I really didn't like. Which was the Darth Nihilus stage. And I was really happy. Most of my characters survived, or all of them actually. I can say this, I like Qui-Gon's outfit, I do like a lot of the characters that I have in my roster. Pretty cool. I like my Jedi Counselor outfit, or the, the character with the Jedi Counselor, which is basically me. Definitely like Qui-Gon Jinn's attacks, pretty cool. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. And um, yesterday... I've heard that, uh, not today, but yesterday or even the day before it, 22 of February, uh, the great, in my opinion, the great author of the Monty Python series has died. Unfortunately. And I decided to do a um, commemoration piece, so to speak. <coughs> Damn my vote. I decided to do a commemoration speech. Or not a commemoration speech, more of a... Ah. A clay figure. I decided to do a statue. Yes, good, good. I, found it. I found the word I need to find. Anyway, I decided to do a statue with one of the Monty Python's characters, Kong Arthur. The main character in one of the shorts, or in one of the main stories. Where with a um, monster attacking rabbit, pretty much. If you know that one, then it's that. It's the beginning part and the end part of the Monty Python story. And... I think I will do him with a sword. And with him, you know... Being happy, but also leaving gifts. Which are three hand-holy grenades. 
No, actually two. Sorry. He leaves two hand holy grenades. And I think a flower I will make him leave. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat. I will make him leave a flower. And he will have a sword. I think he will have a sword up. And he will have one of the holy hand grenades holding in his hand. Not activated. And I will do a little... I will do a little tombstone or a coffin for the creator himself as a little tribute for the things he has done. Also, I watched Monty Python a bit. And it was good. It was a good movie. It was a good... <coughs> Sorry, my throat. Again. I've been a bit... <clears throat> I've been a bit bad in my throat. Anyway, I wanted to do a little tombstone or a coffin to represent the creator a bit. Not as anything bad, but uh, I wanted Monty Python, the main character of uh, the Kong Arthur character, the King Arthur character, to give a flower and to put the two hand holy grenades in there on the, on the top of the coffin. And yeah, I think that would be good. That's a nice statue tribute, more or less. And the guy died of his of his natural or unfortunate disease as well. I don't remember the name of the disease, but it's unfortunate. But even the most greatest will be remembered long time after all after even I am dead so also I've watched the movie and I enjoyed it for what it was and if we can say this you know his creation will live on until TV doesn't exist I suppose Pretty much. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Have a time enjoy. We're playing the game. <coughs> anyway, if you wonder why I'm stu why I'm stuttering a bit, it's because I have been a bit sick these past weeks. Sometimes I've been a bit sick in my throat. Sometimes, so yeah. But anyway, it's going very good in my Star Wars, in my own Star Wars fanfiction book. It's going very good. Oh, come on. Anyway, whatever. It's I'm gonna eliminate you. Bye bye, sir. You know, I can say this, I really enjoyed John Boyega, I did. But when I saw the script for episode 9, uh, the Cole Trevorrow script, and the artwork a bit, I enjoyed, you know, I really wanna wanted... <coughs> Sorry, my throat again. One second. I really would have wanted to see that version of the movie. And in retrospect, I will say that there were some good parts in this movie, but it doesn't justify for the system that, in my opinion, that, you know, Disney has bought this thing. And if I was Disney, I would take care of this. This is a long franchise, with opportunities. Still opportunities, though. It's pretty damaged by this point, but... That's my opinion, it's pretty damaged by this point, but it can still be saved. But it's not dead, in my opinion. So long, it's more talented artists. And... 
The Obi-Wan show gets great. Also, I forgot to mention, the Star Wars The Clone Wars is gonna come out February 27, I think. And I lost. Wah, wah. Okay. Do they wanna play a bit dirty? If they wanna play a bit hard, I will play stronger than them. So, I like the clones though, I do. Let me see, hope you enjoyed the video. I think we need resistance then. The sad part is that, from what I see from the concept art from other YouTubers that are pretty cool. Um, Star Wars Theory, Star Wars Theory, anyway I hope I said that right. And I see the concept art for The Force Awakens. And I wonder what could have been in one aspect, you know? Oh, we already have a Finn. We already had a Poe. Poe, Resistance Pilot. That's what he was. <clears throat> Damn, my throat. <clears throat> That what he was before. Ah, pretty good. I like his outfits from then. You know, I think I will stick to the parts of canon of a, a post backstory of his parents. That's a good idea. And I will stick with him being, uh, you know, his personality from the first movie, which was basically like, you know, Kind of a pilot that's badass, swag. That's a bit... <clears throat> My throat, that's a bit swag like um, like Lando. That's a bit swag like Lando. Has style. It's a bit rebellious, but... Or, he follows orders. But, you know. He has a bit of a swag, we could say. I don't know how you pronounce that exactly, but... So I upgraded him a bit, that's good, yeah, very good, yeah. Also, the sad part is that... Uh, I can say this, I want to say one thing about Rose Tiku. She had more opportunities if she was handled better. Just my opinion, though. It's just my opinion. Don't attack me. Don't attack me for it, come on, okay? It's not fair. Anyway, it's my opinion, though. <sighs> yeah, my throat. Hmm. I think it's a good idea to level her up, though, if I need to use her later. Though, I still don't like Hall, though. Still don't like her, though. No, uh oh. oh. Let me see, can I farm this guy? I can't. Wah, wah, wah. So you know what, we're gonna upgrade Finn here. I think that's good. I think that's enough for now. And if we want to get Jedi Knight Ray, we need to upgrade more of the other characters we have. Which I think is a good idea. Ah, oh, this is a tank version. Okay, you know what, grab this, to be fair, it's like... Ah, it's nothing. Small potato. Upgrade the leadership, why not? Upgrade this one too. Yeah, I think that's good. You get resources one at a time. <clears throat> Damn it, my throat.
Hmm. They don't have a leadership, do they? Huh. Which one of the characters have a leadership? Finn has it, huh? Yeah, she's the best one I have, though. I have hundreds of these, like, it's insane. I cannot do that. Wah, wah. Yeah, I can say this. I only upgrade her for to get the legendary character for the event, so... Eh, not so bad. To be fair, it's... Let me see, where do you get the shards? Yeah, I'm almost done with the shards, so... At least something. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'm gonna do the event soon, yeah. Pretty much. We're gonna put him, yada yada, there, and there. I think that should work. It's a bit funny. Okay, I'm gonna upgrade the other guy so we have a bit more strength. Let me see which type of gear am I using. Oh, 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 oh. Yikes, boy. Damn. Damn, son. Yeah, one on more there. Not there. <clears throat> Damn, my throat. Sometimes I cannot get my breath. Upgrade is basic. It's a good idea to upgrade all the attacks, actually. That's good. Good again. Ah, you need to win, you need to lose something, you know? Again and again, sir. Not bad. Hmm. I think it's equal to upgrade to five. Pretty good. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hmm, I'm gonna upgrade this too. It's a good thing to upgrade weaker characters. You never know when you need him. I should have collected this guy from Rogue One, but I will do it eventually. Sometimes you need to do extra prepare. <clears throat> Sometimes you need to do extra preparation. <clears throat> Damn it, okay. Come on. What is it now? Don't tell me the event is dying. Oh god. There we go. Come on there. Piss weak, seriously? Okay. That was an understatement. Nani? Eh. At least I don't need to upgrade him again. Okay. They want to play rough. They are gonna go flying. Okay. I think the dark side will do great. Ah, you win, you lose something, you know? You win, you lose some credits. Could collect more. Hmm. I need more for these. So I can upgrade my Sith Lord of Darkness. Hmm, maybe they should have another version. <coughs> my throat, damn it. I have not a ship though. Womp womp womp. I will get it eventually. Okay. You know, I like Kylo Ren a bit. He was the best part, too. One thing is, 
in the original Travora version. <clears throat> my throat, god damn it. <clears throat> Hope you enjoy the video. In the original Travora version, he had always the mask on. Only in specific moments he took off the mask. But you know, I can say this. At least I like the concept art, and we will see what we can do with those. To be fair, I like his moveset though, from this movie picture, or from this character. Oh, come on. Yay, I got one more piece. Now you win, you lose, you know? Hmm. Two more less, huh? Or two more left, huh? Hmm. We need one more Dark Sider. Dark Nihilus. Lord of the Pain. No, not Dark Nihilus, sorry. Dark Sion. Lord of Pain and Death. And Reincarnation. Kind of reincarnation because he cannot fucking die. Sorry, <clears throat> he cannot die. Oh, they give instant heal less buff. Oh, come on, you prick. Oh my god, you're jackass. Sorry, I don't mean anything you. <clears throat> I don't mean any one of you guys, but I mean the enemies in the game. Jesus Christ. They want me to die badly, huh? Okay, time to give them the pain. Give me your life force. Stun this fellow. For your insolence, you must die. Dark Palpatine. Sorry, Palpatine. Bye bye, sorry. Maybe they should have a new version. But the thing is, I like Revan. I do like Revan. P.S. Disney should not have deleted the EU. That's stupid. Just my opinion, though. How do you dare strike us down, you fool? Give me my life back. Goodbye, fool. Be gone, traitor. Okay, they wanna play tough, huh? I know I can play that. Bye bye. Fool. Double weakness. And Kylo Ren for the win with the mask. To be fair, I like the weapon. Pretty cool though. <laughs> hmm. Oh my Jesus, my lord. Sweet, sweet, sweet developer Jesus. Oh my god. Seriously, I wish I had this man. Seriously, I wish. Also, I had him in a couple of times before. As the developers, you know, this is the final fight. So it's basically like, you know, fully maxed out stuff. Hmm. I can say I like the design at least. Pretty cool. But I like the look, but I can say this character development needed to be fixed extremely much with her. Just my opinion though. 
<clears throat> my throat. <clears throat> Just my opinion. It is actually my own opinion. The sad thing is that General Hux in the Contravar. <clears throat> In the first director of the episode 9, the first director anyway, I forgot his name again, but the first director basically made so Hux would die seppuku style, eh, which actually, you now when I think about it, makes a bit more sense. Stunned. Bye bye. Grenade. Bada bim bada boom. Oh, Kylo Ren is attacking me. Boo hoo boo hoo boo 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 hoo. Flames for Hux. Goodbye, Hux. That gotta hurt, though. And... I think we're gonna use Obi-Wan. Hmm. Come on. Oh, that's so much damage. Oof. Bada bim bada boom. Hmm. Interesting benefits. She has three Sedas? Holy Jesus Christ. Obi-Wan has one. Or two details two. Yeah, pretty much. Hmm. Cleansing. And bye bye. Victory is mine. I think I will try this. So we're gonna move Palpy. And we're gonna put Invader with his daughter. And his son. It's kind of a family reunion. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat. It's kind of a family reunion in this case. And then we have Palpatine there. Good, 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 yeah. Stun that man. And I'm getting my ass whooped right now. No. Yep, retreat. I think the best choice in this case is to have one solid team. Sorry, Vader. We need to have Obi-Wan. And share it in way, I think. First, gonna put Luke there. I think that should provide with us with a lot of stuff, though. Hmm. Do I do want to have my Dark Nihilus that can one-shot the person? You know what? Sorry, Leia. You need to stay in the back seat for a second. <clears throat> They're critical damage. Oh. That's very mean. Put my defense. We're gonna take out that guy. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. 
Goodbye, you fool. The one I need to defeat is Kylo. He's the one that's strongest. Good, very good, yeah. Missed. Bye bye. Take down his buffs. Oh, you want to hurt me? I'm sad. But no, you are gonna go down, little fool. Because you don't defeat the badass Luke Skywalker, that's for sure. You don't defeat him without a fight. Anyway, open the video. I'm gonna end it pretty soon when I unlock the character and get this reward, actually. Stunned little Kylo, sorry. You know, it would be interesting who would win. Kylo or Luke in his prime. I think Luke. Oh, well, Kylo could put up a fight. Missed. And goodbye, Kylo. Sniper shot. Smash the face. And victory is finally mine. Eventually, on this stage, like, seriously, on these types of stages, I don't win like this. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Unlock the character for free. Don't mind if I do. Hope you enjoyed the video. <clears throat> Seriously? Hmm? Yeah, why not? We're gonna level him up. At least I can do that. At least to that level. Hmm, he needs a lot of good resources, though. That one not. Let me upgrade his basics. I have a lot of resources, so I can do this. I think that was good, very good, yeah, and I'm gonna get these for a second, just to get the extra money. Anyway, we'll see you next time, goodbye.